What's up guys, it's Vive Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you some insane investment opportunities that are going to help you make some guaranteed coins on FIFA 21. Now if you are enjoying the content or you are new around here, I ask that you guys jump over to the channel here and you hit that subscribe button. We're going to try to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of FIFA 21, so it would mean a lot if you guys did subscribe. And then if you enjoy live streams, make sure to come check out the Twitch channel, drop a follow, hang out in the live streams, and make sure to check out all the other links in the description like Twitter, uh, TikTok, Discord, all that good stuff. Drop a follow or, do you, or whatever you want on all those. Now with all that said, let's just jump right into this investment opportunity. So guys, this is going to be a little bit of a long explanation for something simple just to kind of give you the idea of what you need to be doing. So with all these promos that come in Viva 21, we typically get upgrade packs, promo packs, all that good stuff. Right now what's out is not what we're looking for basically for this investment. Right now what's out is we have this 83 plus double upgrade, we have these 82 to 88 upgrades, stuff that nobody really cares about. What we're going to be focusing on is when the 81 plus player picks get released. And what these are is typically it's you submit 11 gold players, usually like seven rare, six rare, something like that, maybe five, and you get a player pick in return. And what this does is this spikes the price of low rated common golds and rare golds because people like to submit these for the player picks because the player picks are fun, they give you good fodder, all that good stuff. So when the player picks are out, all these gold players are way up in price and there's a ton of demand for them. And when the player picks aren't out, these prices just crash big time. So what I want to show you is a no risk guaranteed way to make coins off of this. So basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to go quality gold. And the simplest way to do this, honestly, is you just come in here quality gold. If we look at max buy now 400, look at all these players here. We got tons and tons of players literally just sitting here for 400 coins. Hutchinson right here. Let's go take a look at him on Footbin. So I'm going to bring you over here to Footbin. Right now I have a different player up. But we're going to look up this Hutchinson guy I just showed you. So if we look up Hutchinson here, as we just showed you, he's sitting there for 400 coins. We could just buy him right now. I mean, in the first place, okay, 450 right there on PlayStation. If we look at his graph here, you can tell every spot that player picks are released, which is the funny part with the graphs of these gold common players. Look at this, a spike here. So you know player picks were out right here because his price spiked up. So player picks went away, his price drops back down to 400. Player picks are released, the price goes up. Down, player picks, down, player picks that were released like last week, they just went away. So as you can see, the price jumps like crazy. He he over doubles in price when player picks are out to about 950. You could typically sell all these gold commons for a thousand coins when player picks are out. So that's just kind of something basic I wanted to show you. So you can kind of get the idea of why this method works. So how this method works and if you have a ton of coins, why would you do this? So let me explain this to you. So I know what you're thinking. This Hutchinson, he's 400 coins. Yes, he goes up to 1,000. You can make 600 coins. I'm sitting on 2 million coins. What does that do for me? Now, people, I think this is a very underrated method of investment because what you could do is basically these player picks come out with almost every single promo, and I guarantee you they'll be here for team of the season, shapeshifters, whatever is going to be in the future. So what you could do is say I have these 2 million coins. If I just went through and I bid say 350 coins 400 if i bid 400 coins every gold common just completely spent all my cold all my coins on gold commons kept them all in my unassigned and just waited for the next promo i could essentially double my coins um maybe even call it two and a half times my coins because i'm buy for 400 sell for 1k i obviously have to take tax into account but say I did that, I could very quickly here go from 2 million to 5 million coins from a simple investment like this because you can make two and a half times your coins per card, which is wild. So basically the idea of this is you don't want to do this right now because the player picks just went away. We're going to have a while until they come back. But what you want to do is say you went in 
like three day, like two three days before foot birthday was released. So it's like a two three day hold for however much profit you want to make, basically. And you could bid as low as you want. You can sell as high as you want. You could sell these guys for probably twelve hundred a piece if you sold at the right time and just consistently relisted them. It really just depends how much time you want it to take. But if you're investing two million into this, you're gonna want to sell them at lower prices so they sell on quicker. But I think the wrong idea people get with this is that it's a low met it's a low budget investing method. It's low budget in the sense that anyone can do it. It's just to what degree you want to do it to. If you have 10 million coins, you could do this and instantly be at 20 million coins in three, four days time. You just wait for the next promo, couple days before it, load up on all these cold commons, 400 coins, sell them all for a thousand. It's a very simple method. It's guaranteed coins. And I think it's something that flies under the radar because people are looking for all this crazy stuff like special cards, icon flips that kind of stuff. But I think it's very simple, very reliable, and you literally can't lose coins on it here. So guys, that's gonna be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.